Do Japanese hate weaves? Japanese don't mind if you like anime. Ah, なるほどな。Hello everyone, it's Mrs. Eat. So some people asked questions about Japan on Google. Today I'm going to answer them. 覚悟はいいか。俺はできてる。Let's go. Why do Japanese not wear shoes inside? Why do you? I want to ask you, why do you wear shoes in the house? Thank you for inviting me. Oh, don't take off your shoes. We wear our shoes in the house. Oh. What if you step on the poop on the road and then you, you, you wear the shoes in the house and then you relax on the bed and your feet are on the bed with poop? Sometimes you're. Your kids, you know, crawl on the floor. They might end up rubbing their face on the ground with the dog poop. So I think it's very dangerous. How do Japanese show affection? Like this. Kanjo! We do have very famous line when you, you know, confess your love to somebody. Ano, ano toki kara zutto. So in English it means I have loved you since then. I know it's like a translation is a little weird, but if I translate the that Japanese pickup line pick up line into English, will be like this. Another one is. 大丈夫。他のみんなが君の味方じゃなくても、僕は味方だから。Don't you worry. Even though everybody hates you, I still like you. A lot of girls、uh, who who show their affection to the boy, you know, boy boy and girl walking together. You might hold her hand, but for Japanese people,、uh, they they hold the sleeve of the person, and then the girl might hold your index finger when you're walking. Or if they are more adventurous, they might touch your arm. If you come to Japan, you will see you you will see that there are not many you know young couple that that like show affection in public like this. Why do Japanese cover their mouth? So if you don't know,、uh, some Japanese women cover their mouth when they laugh or when they eat or when they're surprised. So in Heian era, noble people, especially for women, the makeup. They put was very very interesting. So first of all, you have to almost paint your face completely white, and then you pull out all the eyebrows and then draw your eyebrows here on the forehead. But it so it looks sounds very weird for us now. But to be beautiful at that time must be like mysterious, and then then it doesn't exist kind of beauty because the makeup was so thick. So if they smile or if they laugh. The makeup will crack, right? And it's not very beautiful. So mainly female or was, was carrying a big fan to cover their face to avoid seeing something funny or weird. And then this action passed down to the modern time. So I think that's why people, you know, cover their mouths in Japan when they laugh or even when they eat because it's more like a sophisticated, sophisticated, sophis, sophisticated. Sophisticated. It looks more sophisticated. How do Japanese eat rice and stay thin?、Um, first of all, a lot of foreign tourists complain when they come to Japan is they get such a small portion of food in the restaurant or at home as well. And also, we have a saying "hara hachibu me ni suru" means try to keep 80% your stomach is full. So that's the key to have a healthier life. So not all Japanese are thin. I talk more about this topic in this video. We also do a lot of daily exercise. For example, a lot of Japanese people don't drive to work. They tend to take a public transportation, take a bus, and then from the bus stop you walk to school, walk to the workplace. So it's very normal part of everyday life. What does Japan smell like? I like this question a lot. In early spring, it smells like plum blossom. Ume in Japanese, the ume tree, ume blossoms smell like very sweet and very fruity. The scent is pretty strong, so I really, really love it. And in summer, if you were on a crowded train or bus, 
you could smell like a deodorant sheet smell. And then also my husband said that the uh, <laughs> summer in Japan smell like a uh, mildew clothes. You know, in Japan, we don't really use a clothes dryer. People usually hang clothes to dry. So, you know, some clothes are not completely dry, so it's kind of moist and it has a certain smell. In fall, which is my favorite season, smell like kimokuse flower. So I think it smells like a sweet vanilla, but fruity at the same time. You're gonna love this. And winter, <laughs> no smell at all. Just, it's too cold to smell anything. Your nose just frozen. Why do Japanese bathe together? Uh, for Japanese people, going to a public bath with their friends or co-workers is actually a... How to say? Hey, let's go to the public bath together means, hey, let's get more close. <laughs> That's makes sense. Let's get a closer relationship. <laughs> and we even have a saying, uh, hadaka no tsukiai. Hadaka no tsukiai literally means naked relationship. Nothing romantic, but that's how we, how Japanese people get, try to get closer to the person. We also wash each other's back. So you wash somebody's, your friend's back, and then your friends wash your back back. So if you want to know more about Japanese public bath etiquette, please check out this video. Do Japanese hate weaves? Hmm, I know two weebies. Uh, who are actually I'm very close and then they're both living in Japan both of them are really really good good guys I like them a lot you know they are funny and then you know they're nice and Japanese don't mind if you like anime games or trains we don't really mind so I have a couple of pictures here of mm -hmm. some weeb guys weeb guys and I want you to tell me if people in Japan would like them or not like them. Okay. <laughs> okay. Oh, so this guy in the middle, right? Oh, I don't. I don't know why people would hate him. He, he has a nice smile and he's doing this, bro, like a yang yang. Oh, that's cool. Why? No problem. Oh, I would be friends with him. He really is into uh, Dragon Ball and any other anime. So it's good. He should be proud of it. Ah, If I met him and he asked me to come to his house, if it was like this, I would be a little bit overwhelmed. I wish he would, you know, said something. Uh, you know, my, my room is full of, you know, those, you know, um, cute girls, you know, but they are actually animes. So this is like a daki makura, right? In Japanese, daki makura, daku is hug, hugging the pillow. What is this pillow for? And why he's standing in front of the bed? Ai! Taiko janai desu ka? Yeah, I'll be Takshido Kamen sama. Oh, that's so nice. I like how he kept his beard. You know, he has his keep his identity, you know? Mm, Japanese people will give him a little bit cold gaze. But some, I'm sure some, some you know, young kids try to take a picture with him or they secretly take a picture of him. He just tried to look like a girl in the Daki Makura, right? Can I be friends with him? Mm, I don't know. I need to know his personality, but if he walks around with a wig and this Daki Makura, if you go to Denden Town, you know, those kind of uh, like a mecca for nerdy kids, you'll be fine. My love. This is my love. Love of my life! <laughs> this is my husband when he was in college. I really, really like this picture, so I actually set this picture as my, as my profile picture for many months. And a lot of friends started asking me, Is that you when you were young? <laughs> and I said, No, it's my husband. And they stopped asking me questions. You know, I, I really like how he, you know, strapped his backpack here, you know, it's so safe. It tells a lot of things about his personality. He's a good guy, safe guy, and smiley. Look at the cities, so beautiful. And his hair is so sara sara, you know? Like silky smooth. I wish I could have the hair like his. So these are the questions people ask on Google. What question do you have? Please let me know in the comment below. Thanks for watching, guys. Okini!